Hello, I'm Professor Riley, and this is the science of things. And today's science is apple science. They say an apple a day keeps the doctor away, but what do they have to say when it's a doctor eating an apple all the time? Building a robot is great if you need a little extra help around the house, or if you just want a new friend, but did you know you could make a robot out of an apple? I'm going to show you how. The first thing you'll need is an apple, and you need to cut it like so. The next step is to apply a stick to the top of the apple. Some people use string, but I recommend a stick. Then, you're going to need to find some googly eyes and put them on the top of the apple. Look at this. We're almost done. Now we all know that what makes a robot is the intelligent computer brain, but what if you're on a tight budget? Well, instead of going to a computer store, what you can do is take a paper clip and put it on some clear tape, and then put it on the back of your apple while making some beep beep noises. Beep beep beep! Look at that! A microchip, and it cost me nearly nothing. And you see, just like that, we have an apple robot for pennies on the dollar. Now that's some apple science. Hey, do you want to hear a knock-knock joke? No, I don't want to hear a joke. Do you want to hear a knock-knock joke? No. Knock-knock. No. Knock-knock. Knock-knock. Who's there? Michael Jackson. No, I don't want to hear it. Michael no, Jackson. No. no. Michael no, Jackson. No, no. Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson. All right. Great. Great. Thanks a lot. Yeah, this is exactly why I can't build robots. Every single time. All right. Sorry, God. Do you want to talk about we it? We are talking about it. No, you're not talking about it. You're yelling about it. And if you want to yell about it too, I can yell too, goddammit!